Hey guys. Welcome to Couple. Please like and subscribe if you like the video. Edward Cullen and Bella Swan are making a big comeback on the screen. Seven years after Twilight, Breaking Dawn, Part 2 hit theaters, Lionsgate has planned a new series of movie events to engage fans. The first Twilight movie is set to get an international tour set to live music, in which the movie will play and be accompanied by a full orchestra who will tackle Carter Burwell's iconic music. In an announcement, Lionsgate revealed that the first of these concerts will come out in August and will happen in Brazil. Subsequent shows will stop in places like Australia and the UK, the full set of dates is not available currently. This isn't the first time Lionsgate has planned a series of events like this for fans, having also done this for the likes of The Hunger Games and La La Land. So far, 125 performances for these previous projects have already been successfully launched. Insofar as Twilight goes, the fanbase is definitely still big enough for this sort of event. In fact, I'm a little bit surprised an actual movie spin-off hasn't happened in the universe since the last flick wrapped in 2012. After all, the franchise has brought in $3.3 billion worldwide across four movies and clearly there's still an avid fanbase interested in Bella Swan and Edward Cullen, plus the Cullen family in general. We even recently learned the Twilight franchise films have been big hits with a new audience over at Hulu. Insofar as a reboot or remake goes, previously actor Callan Lutz has talked about the budget constraints in the first movie, revealing he wouldn't mind if the powers that be remade Twilight, particularly to improve the CGI. Definitely for the first movie, I think Twilight has the lowest budget out of all of them from New Moon, Eclipse, Breaking Dawn, and I can only imagine what Catherine Hardwick would do if she had a $59 million budget compared to $37 million budget of the first. So, I think they could remake the first one, but I don't think they could remake or should remake the franchise until there is some new technological advancement. I think the CGI was already top-notch in the movies. While this sort of new sort of screening event isn't the same thing as a new movie, these types of events have proven popular for a lot of different big and small screen properties. At other studios, programs like The Simpsons have done similar live projects. In addition, some properties with musical components have even delved into sing-along fan events, with the greatest showman being a prominent recent example.